All right, here we are again, folks. We are doing an audit on the Western Avenue police station. I think that they've already called them and notified them that I'm on my way because I can see police officers standing outside. Um, we're going to make sure we don't jaywalk, though. So we don't get in any trouble. See if we make contact. They come over here. Let me get my GoPro working. And that's kind of strange that he already sees me. And he's already coming up. Alright. And he is not going to approach me, so. Hey, that's Jay walking. Alright, so. One police officer, Jay walking to start. Walking through cars like it doesn't matter. Total disregard, disrespect for the law. And yet they will write tickets to others for that exact thing. So we have a police officer here getting ready for his duties today. Good morning, sir. How are you today? You getting ready for your duties today? Yes. Right, you be safe out there. What's your name? Thank you. Carter. Carter. Nice to meet you, sir. What's your badge number? Oh. You look young. Don't that. Hopefully you represent a new culture, man. Thank you. All right, here we are. And it's like this is not a police car, but it is parked in front like they own it so we get that license plate number yep, no I'm good gentlemen how are you you guys are approaching me slow down slow down back up back up oh okay you're going that way okay all right I don't want to get killed Have a good day. you guys be safe out there all right now we have another car Looks like it's not a police car also And we have plenty of cars, plenty of Albany Western Avenue police cars. Shouldn't be any crime in this area. But I notice that they're all sitting here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, eighteen police cars parked not being used seems kind of strange don't you think I would think that uh, uh, they would be working I don't know Albany needs them if there's 18 police officers Let's see if I can zoom in on that a little bit Alright, so, obviously, we got some editing software here, there's some kind of memorial in front of the police station, I'm not sure, it's definitely public, you can see there are benches. Dedicated, erected by the residents of 13th Ward. So they've got some community respect, I see. Planning courtesy of these neighborhoods. And it looks like we got a police chief, sergeant, lieutenant, something like that over here. Looks like he wants to be in the corner. This is all right. My GoPro going. Morning, sir. How are you today? I am well. Uh, no, that's okay. Thank you, though. But I'd like to uh, know your name and badge number if that's all right. I, you got a card? Let me 
gonna introduce myself. Hold on, let me just turn Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I don't wanna turn my camera. I don't wanna approach you without permission. That's right, let's turn my camera. Morning, sir, how are you today? Is that a lack of uh, respect for the community, sir? <laughs> oh, that's a definite disrespect. You're a tyrant. You're a thug. You're a punk. Oh, we got a punk here, folks. The guy that came out looked like he was going to be professional. This guy's a punk. Wow, look at that. He's even got a club on him to beat people with. Look at that. This guy is ready for war. And he's just policing the opening New York. How many times is he going to use that? As many as possible, folks. Because he's that kind of person. Look at him. He's got a small dick. So he's going to sit there and now take it out on the community. Ooh, did that bother you? Hit a nerve there, sir? They hit, oh, look at that. Oh, I'm a big, powerful man.